Hi there, welcome to my channel. So today I decided to discuss a plant watering system while away on vacation. Over the course of several years I've tried several different systems for watering plants while I'm on vacation and then typically on vacation between two and three weeks or sometimes three and a half weeks. For designing a uh, plant watering system I inspired myself from YouTube, different user posts, different ideas and one of the most popular system is that of a um, um, bottle of water and on the side it's pierced so that you can insert a thread or a rope and through the capillary action the water rises in, in the rope, in the threads of the rope and after that it's pulled down through the gravitational pull and of course the capillary, uh, the surface tension pulls the water out from uh, the bottle and this thread is supposed to stay above the plant and it will drop by drop it will water the plant however I found this system rather unsatisfactory and the reason for that is because first the, 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 the water flux or the volume that the water is uh, the plant is watered depends on how long for example this thread comes down from the wire for example if it's only this long then the flux of water is very low just because there's not much gravitational pull for the water accumulated in here then if it's longer the flux is longer but to get it from here to the plant uh, then the flux is very high so eventually the water will be consumed very fast in the first couple of days and after that there's nothing else to do because then the plant has too much water I typically have small plants and they don't need so much water so the idea is to uh, regulate the flux of water so that it receives a drop let maybe only every five minutes or so the second problem with this method here is that the um, this thread will will dry out if it's very warm and then this doesn't work anymore so I decided to improve this system and make my own and also try to regulate the flux to match it to the to the plant so I decided today to improve this by making my own system so my system consists of the same is the same principle with the thread of uh, the thread of cotton for example into a straw straw like this that you uh, use to, to drink from uh, juice or something like that and then um, I have a distributor here and I can distribute then the, the watering system through three different plants or more if I want so the way you do this you will you need first um, straws and these are pretty universal on they can be found pretty much anywhere and then another thing that you need so I will take for this reason three straws four straws the main one and another thing that you need is a thread thread of cotton I have here and the length of the cotton of course I have to then match it to the straw sticks so but the idea is to have to, to wrap the straws to pull it into the straws the reason for having straws first of all is that it prevents the evaporation and then the thread of cotton doesn't completely go through the, the whole way through so this is just to use as a guiding line and the threads of cotton stops around here and of course by pulling them back and adjusting the fluxes if it's too much so I will take this cotton thread of cotton and I will wrap it in let's say wrap it four three times 
so if you get the idea so you see I will fold it three times so I have three wires now three wires and with these three wires I'm gonna slide them through the main straw here the main straw and to do this I need a wood stick so that I push the thread in and it goes well quite nicely and then we have our I should get the cotton thread on the other side so the reason I use this cotton thread is also because it's very soft so it's not it's not very hard all right so this here we are at the end we're gonna use this side to sink in to the water to dip into the water bottle and I'm gonna make a knot here just so that I don't end up with no wire on this side so in case I pull on this side this stops now the key is this side here so these are gonna these are the three threads that I'm gonna use to distribute in three different plants yeah all right so this much should suffice so I do this because I, I've tried already and then this seems to be the optimal flux that I need for watering the plants so actually plants love it much more when the they are wetted very slowly drop by drop then when you pour with a bottle then you water them with with a water bottle and so on so this system should also work when not only that you are in vacation but also when you're at home and what you need to do is just to replenish the water that has been consumed so essentially what I'm doing now I'm bringing in the threads into the each separate straws and as you can see the length of the threads coming out from the main thread is not so long it's just sufficient to pull to pull on the water by a surface tension and these straws will going to act as guiding lines and also will prevent the evaporation of water and this system works significantly better than anything else that I've tried so far so I'm sharing this with you and hopefully it will also work out for you so my plants are very small and they have very small containers for my plants I don't need that much water so there you go I achieved this operation here and now you can see my distributor water distributor now in order to hold it, put it in place I use some plastiline or some clay whatever you have and you can use this is kind of a, it's a moldable mass that I can wrap it around just to hold this in place and then just glue it in place and so on so just a that it stays all right oops it's coming out I have to be careful what I'm doing here because then by filming and doing this operation at the same time is not so easy so just wrap this clay around or plastiline or silly putty whatever you want to call it and this is how we made our distributor all right so I straighten this in place now just to make it here more more fancy okay and essentially this is gonna come into the bottle water bottle 
and this I'm gonna pull on this if the flux of water is too high and this is gonna work as a distributor so it's pretty much the same system I've done here so when you dip it into water the water due to capillary action it will raise into the cotton thread which is also very hydrophilic then the second process will start that is also capillary action will continue to drive into to wet the thread the cotton thread but the longer this outside thread is due to surface tension it will pull more water and you achieve some kind of siphoning effect where the water is now withdrawn due to capillary action gravitational pull but also surface tension and it will come into these wires of course one at the end the end of the cotton threads are here but then when water pearls up or forms a droplet here then it will be guided into the thread and it will um, water the plant so after this video I'll make a time-lapse film and I will show you how this essentially works this works very well I highly recommend it and I hope you can also use it this uh, I've done earlier so it takes quite a while for the water to raise into the into the thread but then it's just droplet by droplet works fantastically well thanks for watching I hope this was useful and see you next time bye bye